What's good, guys? Prince Sports here, man, coming at you with another one. Now, Carmelo Anthony has put the Lakers on his back tonight, basically. Helped them get that W against the Grizzlies. And um, it, it was close because if John Morant hits that free throw, then guess what? The game is tied and it goes into overtime. But Carmelo Anthony is now officially on the top 10 scorers list. This is a longevity award for him because um, it took him a while to come on his list. He's, he passes Moses Malone. He is now the ninth um, highest scorer in NBA history. So um, congratulations to him, I guess. But uh, this one's a longevity award. There's two types of scoring awards for players, okay? A player could get a scoring award in his prime as he just keeps climbing up that chart in a dominant fashion. You know, um, it only took Mike a very few years to get to 32,000 because he was such a devastating scorer. A 10-time 10, 10 scoring champ. Guy had seasons when he's dropping 30 plus, you know. So he was a little more potent on the scoring end. But a guy like Carmelo Anthony, he's been in the league forever. He's another dinosaur. And it took him all these years to get to number nine on the scoring list. So it's a longevity award more than... Um, an in-prime award and dominating the game from in your prime. Now, I'm more fascinated with that than longevity awards because any superstar, any guy that knows how to play basketball, they could be on the top 10 uh, scores list or any other top 10 list if they play long enough because they are all-time great, a future Hall of Famer anyway. So they're going to win regardless anyway in that aspect, okay? So basically... Um, yeah, man, it was a pretty good game. Lakers get their first game of the season after losing basically like eight games in a row if you add the uh, the preseason, you know. So they get their first win tonight. Um, I noticed one thing about the Lakers, though. Um, LeBron James didn't have the ball in his hands as much, and this is the way to go. You got to let those other guys flourish, and you got to give the team to AD, okay? LeBron's a little too old to be having – all those responsibilities to be the number one guy. But then again, it's a fair game because he is the guy prompted as the best player on the Lakers or the top five best player in the game, this, that, and the third. So he's going to have to take that type of spoke and that type of responsibility. You don't get no um, free passes in terms of that. But congratulations to Carmelo Anthony. Nevertheless, um, he's a great I mean, he's a great player, great scorer. Um, there was a time when he was neck to neck with LeBron. Some people thought he was better than LeBron. So, um, you know, he's he, he has a, a pretty solid career. He, he could have won a championship, if you ask me. Um, but he made a couple wrong decisions, let the money do the talking more. And I thought he, he probably thought that the championships would come along with that money. But it didn't uh, happen that way for him. You know what I'm saying? So, but... Nevertheless, man, um, congratulations to Carmelo Anthony. Peace.